This is a Mary May Studio production, where gaming is not for just your average show. Well, we're back playing Edmund. Uh, what is this? American Truck Simulator. Once again, we have new content for this game, too. <clears throat> Started this back in Denver, because I had such a big update to the game. And a whole new state. Wyoming. It was such a big new update, I didn't have to update Pro Mods, which was good. I'd love for Pro Mods to expand into further into BC or Alberta, but I guess we'll see when that happens. Anyway, let's get started with something from Denver. Denver to Denver. What time is it anyway? 6 p.m.? Not leaving at 6 p.m. That's more like it. 8.20 in the morning. Going the wrong way. Here we go. Oh, this is even better. Rail export to Kems in Rollins, Wyoming, Potassium. Yes. I turned the wrong way, didn't I? There we go, now we're on the right road. Okay, so we are picking up from somewhere in here. Oh, I should have refueled and everything first. Why didn't I sleep overnight? You know what? Before I take any job, I'm going to do all that. We'll find places to sleep and that on the way. our potassium and normally I do that between episodes but because we started in our garage I completely forgot about it the part that sucks about having to sleep during the day, so I may only get this one trip in. Okay, now we're on the road. How's everybody doing? It's been a great weekend so far. Oh, crap. Did not even realize I ran a red light. Okay, green here. So, there was the new Jeep DLC that I got for the last episode of SnowRunner. Also the new Phase 5. Which brought a whole new Russian region. Now we got Wyoming now for this game. And I've been trying to watch the new, all the fact sheets that have been coming out for Farming Sim 22. So far they've been, just been showing off some new equipment. Some new brands for the game. The only thing new other than some new combines, new tractors, 
is uh, rock picking. To be able to have a rock picker. There we go. And uh, earlier on they showed off a bunch of the new fertilizer, fertilizing machines for vineyards. The vehicle is not in perfect state. Be more careful next time. Yeah, I, my truck is in pretty bad shape. Do we have to go through the mountains over to uh, what is it? Uh, oh, I forget the name of it now, but I think it was the first one we went to in episode one. Colorado Springs or something like that. Or Steamboat Springs. I, I think that was it. I think Colorado Springs is on the south side. South end of the state. Ooh. Yeah, the dude's getting tired. We're going to need to find a place to pull over soon. And I'm not seeing anywhere coming up there we can do that. Oh, there we go. Wyoming, we're already there? Oh, welcome to Wyoming. Apparently we'll get there at 1 p.m. Which is not for another 1.30, it's not for about two and a half hours. Oh, we're gonna pull off here and get some rest. Ooh. You gotta be kidding me. Gotta pull into another way station? Where? Well, that was a fast drive. I didn't expect us to be in Wyoming that quick. Thought Colorado was in the middle of the state. Ooh. Well, I'm not really in parking space. Here we go. You got a bit of a thunderstorm going on outside. There's a soft flicker in my eye and well, look by a crack of thunder here. Now, where is this way station? Oh, if I would have known that, I would have pulled in here and had a sleep. All I need now is fuel. How is the scale supposed to measure my whole load? I'm not even on the scale with the two trailers. Well, we're good to go anyway. Well, we won't get there till after midnight. What the heck is this now? The hell with you people. I'm going anyway. Actually, let's check the map. Maybe we don't have to. No, I can't get off on that overpass. I have to go all the way down here and come back. Now well, let's do that. Let's do it the right way this time. Maybe while we're doing this, we'll find some fuel. We'll get there to 1.30 now. 
adds a whole hour onto our trip. Shai Chariin discovered, whatever that is. However the heck you pronounce it. Okay, back onto the overpass and up the other side. Oh, I knocked some signs over. Whoops. Now we're just about back on track again. Got to go down, back down the highway. A little bit here. Backtracking, that's the word I'm looking for. Boy, is it ever dark. Buckle up. This truck's going too slow for me. Well, found lots of rest stops, but not enough fuel stations. We must be heading downhill. It's suddenly so much easier to pick up speed. Oh, there's a whole load of fuel stations I just passed. Oh well. Why is neither one of these trucks moving very fast? Go, people! Hey, yeah, there's fuel right up here. And we're already at our final destination here. Well, I guess we're waiting. And here we are. Ready to, to deliver to Kems. Now, here's our parking space. There you go. Thirteen thousand dollars. All right, we'll get fuel and call it a night. Oh, I guess it wasn't that far. We didn't have to go through Steamboat Springs. Should I go back to Laramie? Get fuel and go back there to sleep. Yeah, I think that's going to be closer. First of all, we'll get fuel. Oh, I'm gassing up. Getting a diesel. It's bigger trucks need diesel, not gas. There we go. Check the map and figure out how to get to a sleeping place. Doesn't look like Laramie has anything other than that. Now, why does it say I'm going the wrong way? Oh, come on. There's a guy behind me now. You know, I want to back up without you in the way. There we go. I will be out of your way shortly. Because this is perfectly legal. There we are.
fixed our mistake. Well, we're making a pretty good time. It's a lot easier to get some speed when you don't have a trailer. Good thing is, we can also get a repair while we're here. Okay, good night. Really? It's already two, 3 in the afternoon after sleeping? And let me guess, because the truck dealer's open, I can't... Yeah, I can't skip time. So, we'll take one more. From Laramie. Where's the closest places in Laramie? Drake Car Rental? Laramie to Rawlings. And it won't start out so late in the day, though. Well, we could go back to Denver. Yeah, let's go back to Denver. We'll pick up some cars. Yeah, it's going to the rail export, exactly where we started off from. I always like taking cars. It's always so much fun. When you got to take, uh, go to the international dealership and take uh, big rig trucks. Pulling those are always harder. Especially when you got to take tight corners with them. Okay, so this week, what I'm hoping to get out is uh, also some more Minecraft, get back to that. Some more Shirtless Guy, and I think some more SimCity. Well, I hope you enjoyed Wyoming. I know I did. And a lot of fun. We didn't get to see many of the new trailers or cargo. I'm sure we'll see some of that coming up. We'll certainly be back here exploring the other cities. Now I get to see this road in the daytime. That's kind of interesting in this game. I do like driving in the pitch black, not knowing really where the road is, just following the lines. And then driving that same road again the next day during the day. It's just not that visually appealing to somebody watching. So I never do really go that route. At least not for the channel here anyway. The mountain driving gets deceiving because you think it would take half the day to get there and it ends up taking all day and into the night. Some of these mountain trips. I knew that car would come over. They just swing into your lane when their lane ends. Oh, and I almost missed the turnoff for Denver. But I made it. Seem to have a lot of gates on this highway. Maybe because they have to close the highways a lot in Wyoming. Probably for snow. We're going to get there at 6.30. Yeah, that's a good time to end the day.
I wonder if you're called into the weigh scale more often when your truck isn't in good driving condition, good driving order. There must be a better way of saying that, good driving order. Good condition, I'll just put it that way. We should be there in about half an hour. Which means we must be in Colorado now. Or not Colorado. Of course we're in Colorado. We should be in Denver now. I'm starting to finally get the hang of all these big interchanges. But every city has them all designed differently, so... Kind of hard to get used to sometimes. And we're back. Just in hot time to hear the horrible ringing again. Now we just gotta find where we're gonna park this thing. There we go. Three and a half hours. That was a better trip that time. Nine thousand dollars. We have forty six thousand now. How are we doing for loans? We only have the one, so we're saving up for another truck. We're up in Idaho. Carrying a reservoir tank. And our journey took us to Wyoming. Still lots more to explore. We still got lots of Oregon to explore. Lots of California. I believe we've gone into California once before I reset everything. I think we went to Barstow once. Yeah, we haven't even been to Las Vegas yet. I am going to leave the episode here. Thank you guys so much for joining me. We will join the dude next time. And we'll see what state we end up in next. If you guys enjoyed the episode, please leave a like and feel free to leave a comment. As always, I'm Joe. Thank you guys so much for joining me on the channel today. I will see you guys next time. Have a great day, everybody.